Well, presently we're taking the drywall scraps and we're placing them in the dumpster. And as a rule, drywall is usually a waste product and they're trying to find uses where they can use the drywall. The drywall actually is, uh, is uh, one of the uh, items that uh, farmers actually can use to uh, augment the soil on their fields. So it's taken and actually crushed or grounded and uh, laid out on farmer fields uh, and helps uh, in the soil augmentation. Uh, the thing to realize on construction sites, this is one of the items that really makes up a weight uh, when you're recycling from a construction site. It makes up a huge amount of weight. You can see we probably have a 10 yard or container here and probably our weight will be close to seven or eight tons of material actually coming off this project to recycle. What you're saying is most of the material off a new construction project by weight one of the big ones is drywall. Drywall uh, you know, only uh, superseded by cement itself. So you get those two items uh, recycled on a project, you're guaranteed 50% by just those two items alone. And this is the first time that a Buffalo project ever recycled drywall. You think maybe you get about what? What kind of percentage recycling rate on this job? You have any idea? Well, we're looking at 75% or better. Oh, you think you're going to get into this a little bit more? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. We're going to work very closely with Waste Cap. And um, this is a phenomenal project. Okay.